In MinFOS, you can set up and save order templates for orders that you generate on a regular basis. Using the order template, orders can be set to automatically generate according to a set schedule or be generated by yourself when required. Click on the Order Maintenance icon and then click Order Templates. In the Order Templates window, click Add to create a new order template. To edit an existing order template, select the template and click Change. To remove any unwanted order template, Select the template and then click Delete. If required, search for a particular order template using the Find button or sort the columns using the column headers. Let's now add a new order template. Click Add and the Order Template window is displayed. In the Supplier field, enter the supplier code or name for the order and then press Tab. Select the supplier if required. By default, all department and category fields are included. Leave the two Include All checkboxes ticked. This will ensure all products from the specified supplier are considered when the order is generated. Enter a meaningful description for the order template. In the Order Date field, enter the first date that this template will be run. The delivery time defaults to one day. Adjust this if required. Leave the shelf pack round and order type as the default settings. Leave the order content set as the default to include all products or select either dispense or retail to include only dispense or only front of shop items. In the next date to run field, enter the date that this order needs to be generated for the first time. The frequency selected will run based on this date. In the Frequency drop-down menu, select Once Only to run this order once based on the date set in the next date to run. This order will be retained in the Order Templates list and can be rerun or edited at any time. Select Daily to run this order overnight every day. Select Weekly to run this order overnight every seven days from the date entered or select Fortnightly to run this order every 14 days from the date entered. Select Monthly to run this order overnight each month on the date entered. Each time the order template is run, the next run date will be updated in the template order list according to the frequency that you have selected. The order period in days defaults to seven. Enter the number of days you would like to make this order up to. MinFOS recommend at least 30 days for a monthly order. Leave the Z factor and Roundup fields as the default values. Use the default supplier should remain checked in most circumstances. Check the Include Negatives checkbox if you would like to include items that have a negative stock on hand. Check the Include Out of Stocks 3 Months checkbox to include products that are marked as stocked but have no stock on hand where the product has been sold in the last three months. Check the Include Uncollected Scripts checkbox to ensure scripts waiting at the till are included within the order. Click Save to save the order template. The new order template is listed in the Order Templates window and will run according to the date and frequency that you have set. Orders can be manually run at any time and this will not affect the schedule of the next run date. To generate an order from a template out of the schedule cycle, select the order template and click Change. Click Generate in the Order Template window. The order will appear in the Order Maintenance screen with the created status and the description that was set in the Order Template. Refer to the MinFOS Help Centre to learn more about order templates in MinFOS.